Hello, this is Blue Star, Defender of Equestria, and this is my next blind reaction video. Um, episode 5 of Season 5, so... <laughs> Maybe I'll think of something more cutting to say at the beginning of these, because I don't know anything about the episode, so it's difficult to have something funny or cool to say, so... <laughs> Uh, yes, and hopefully the next video will be, the next episode will be coming on, uh, soon. Uh, it was, last episode was certainly interesting, to say the least. Um, perhaps not the most fun, but definitely interesting. It certainly, uh, did a lot to try to answer questions that I think, uh, the Brodies had for a long time and everything, and it was certainly interesting to see those questions be answered, and, uh, it was interesting. I just... <laughs> that may have been the uh, the word that described that episode the best, and it was really cool to see mm, to see Princess Luna come back. Yay! But I hope this means this isn't the end of Dreamwalking episodes. But, hmm. but anyway, so <laughs> yes, the next episode will be coming on momentarily. So yes, 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 this is gonna be so cool. <laughs> Five, four, three, two. One, start. <laughs> it's like, oh, come on, Capture Program, don't do this to me. <laughs> Get jammed <Jeff> now. <sighs> ah, great for action. Ooh. Oops. Look at that, Tank. What? <gasps> Cloudsdale's here. That means Ponyville is next up for winter! Uh, oh, interesting. <laughs> We've seen that before. <laughs> You're doing awesome, every pony! Keep it up! We need those leaves off those trees! <laughs> yes, sir! I mean, bam! <laughs> Once we get autumn cleared away, it'll be hello winter! <laughs> uh, yeah. Was that a yawn I just saw? It could have been. How can you be tired when the most exciting time of the year is right around the corner? Really? And don't forget the best part! Our first winter together! Oh, well that's cool. Oh. Ugh. Come on, wake up! Once those ponies bring in the big black clouds full of snowflakes, we'll have a ton of snow for our extreme sledding! Oh, okay. <sighs> <laughs> and over there, we can play horse hockey. We'll do shoulder our rope pads. <laughs> Look out! <laughs> nice catch. Uh. Everything's looking great, don't you think? Almost everything. Does Tank look all right to you? I think he's a little tired. Well, he does seem to be moving a little slowly. <laughs> I know, right? But he always does that. And he looks kind of sleepy. Mm. Totally. Just like he always does. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm sure you're right. Yeah. Mm. Uh. Yeah, Rainbow's not convinced. <laughs> my little pony, my little pony. A beautiful heart, faithful and strong, sharing kindness. It's an easy feat, and magic. Yes. Ah, uh, yes, it's the princesses. Oh. <laughs> Oh dear, oh dear. So, um, uh-oh. <laughs> uh, so, um, actually there are a couple interesting things to think about here. It's like, hmm, Rainbow Dash is really excited for winter. Hmm, I'm surprised by that. In general, cultures don't like winter, because, mm, <laughs> oh, let's see, the food shortages, the cold temperatures, the feet, the, the, all the snow on the ground do not make winter enjoyable for most, co for most cultures. <laughs> Oh dear. Oh. <laughs> oh, all I'm gonna say is here is that you know, um, we've definitely had a very rough winter this year on the East Coast. So, oh, <laughs> so yeah, we're uh, not a fan of winter over here. So <laughs> it catches me kind of off guard. Uh, sort of in the same way that Celestia's favorite season is fall. Hmm, 
Interesting. That was an odd choice, but okay. <laughs> um, yeah, so, uh, hmm, yes, and Tank appears to be tired or sleepy or something oh, about something. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> I mean, this this could be an interesting episode. Um, those, we've never, re obviously, we've obviously never really focused on Rainbow Dash and Tank. It's sort of, they've always been sort of in the background. They've never really had any focus. Um, in a way, we've never had any real focus on any of the, uh, the pets and the, uh, the pairings of the, the pets and the ponies and everything. So that might be interesting in itself, but, um, um, I don't know. It's only been the first, like, minute and a half, so there's not too much to, uh, <laughs> comment on, so, um... I guess, but it looks like this could be an interesting one. It's certainly doesn't look like it's going to be another Equestria shattering episode or anything. It seems like we're going to have a nice, it's going to be a little bit more smaller and a bit more focused and everything, which is uh, not necessarily a bad thing and everything. Um, so it'll be um, interesting to see where this goes. <laughs> and hopefully the show will be coming back in like a couple seconds or so because I can't think of anything else to say. So, <laughs> and thankfully it is back. Yes. <laughs> Fluttershy, what are you doing? Well, I suppose his heartbeat could be a teensy, weensy, teensy bit slower than Tanks usual. Thanks for the memories. Okay, so give him a vitamin or something. Okay. I don't think he needs that. Maybe we're just staying up too late. Uh, too many daring do stories. <laughs> oh dear. Well, that's not it either. Well, well, what's wrong with him then? Well, then? What is it? Nothing. He's perfectly fine. Oh. Oh, good. <sighs> that's what. He's just going to hibernate. Oh no. You do realize he's not a bear, right? <laughs> When the weather grows cold and less food is available, many animals hibernate to conserve energy. Hmm. It's like taking a really long nap during winter. And then they wake up in spring. And see, even tortoises do it. When the time comes, Tank will leave and dig into the ground. Oh no! <sighs> but don't worry, he'll reappear when the spring sun warms the ground back oh, up. Oh dear. Come on! Tortoises don't hibernate! <laughs> Some pony put that picture in there as a joke. What? It's not a joke. Well, then your book must be wrong. Ooh. Rainbow oh, Dash. Dear. Tank needs to hibernate. It's healthy for him, just like sleeping is healthy for us. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, thanks. Come on, Tank. Okay. Oh, dear. <laughs> Where are you going? To get a second opinion from a real reptile expert. Ow, that was hurtful. <laughs> sort of. I told you, Rainbow Dash, I'm a dragon! Come on! <laughs> You're practically twins! <laughs> I'm purple? <laughs> but if you don't have to hibernate, why should Tank? Because he's a tortoise, and I'm a dragon! Same family, though, right? No! <laughs> no. I'll take that as a yes. Ugh. Look, if Fluttershy says tortoises hibernate, then I guarantee tortoises hibernate. Well, what would you know? You're a dragon. <laughs> but he just said that. Oh, wait. Oh, this is Spike's room. Oh, no that's cool. No knows you like I do, Tank. All you need is some hard work to get the old blood pumping. Ugh. Oh, dear. Ow. Come on! I can see this is going to be difficult. <laughs> Such a killer time in the snow tank. Oh dear. Tank. The tank. Where, where did he go? No. Tank. Aww. You think you win, oh tank? You all snuggly, snuggly little daddy to hibernate. Don't say that word. Which one? Snuggly. Snuggly. <laughs> Tanky. Hibernate. That one. Oh, I was dear. just saying how cute. It if you think hibernate, you know that napping thing <laughs> is so cute. Why don't you go do it? Oh, oh, Somewhere oh. far away from here. Oh no. <laughs> what are you looking at? Pinkie Pie Nothing. and I are just having a conversation. Look, um. Rainbow Dash, we all know how upset you are about Tank Hyper. Shh. <laughs> don't say that word. That's what started this all. We know how upset <laughs> you are about Tank. But you shouldn't take your anger out on your friends. No. Who said anything about anger? I didn't say anything about anger. I'm not upset, and I am not angry. Do I look angry? 
Yes. She's gonna kill us all. It's like I'm not stressed. I'm totally fine. <laughs> I need you bright-eyed and bushy-tailed, not sleepy-eyed and scaly-tailed. Which is exactly what you are. <laughs> <I was kidding. laughs> but get up anyway. Mm. Oh dear. Uh, Rainbow Dash isn't taking this very well. You can't hybrid. <laughs> no. I can't say what that. What about word. all the primo things we're gonna do together this winter? Poor Rainbow. Building snow ponies, starting snowball fights, sipping hot cider by the fire. Oh dear. Don't you wanna do those things with me? Yes. But, hmm. Think, Rainbow Dash, think! Tank's only hibernating because it's cold, right? Uh oh. Well, I'd rather have him awake in the heat than asleep in the cold. Mm. <gasps> uh -oh. I'll just have to stop winter! <laughs> oh my gosh, that was a dastardly face, alright. Oh no, my dastardly scheme is coming together! <laughs> Uh-oh. He's like, oh, no. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, dear. This is kind of difficult for me. Because let's just say I'm understanding anger very, very well recently. Ah! <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, dear. It's like, oh. It's like, <laughs> yeah, it's like, oh, no. It's like, oh, no. I think the other thing is that, uh... Rainbow is like, Rainbow is, is, as I almost like to say, is like, uh, facts don't get in the way of a good grudge. <laughs> sort of a thing in this case with Rainbow Dash. It's like, you know, it's like she's flat, ignoring what the books and everyone is telling her. It's like, no, this is a, this is, this is a scientific fact. Tortoise is asleep. I don't care. <laughs> it's basically what Rainbow Dash is saying. So, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, and everything. So, ooh, Rainbow Dash is not taking this very well. It's like, no, don't, Turk. You can't hibernate. I want to have fun with you all during winter. You can't go to sleep. No, how could you do this to me? Is probably what Rainbow Dash is thinking and feeling right now. And, oh, poor Rainbow. It's like, all she wants to do is just have fun with her, uh, her pet slash friend and everything, and that's probably breaking her heart at this moment that she can't, that she knows she can't do, do that. That That's not going to happen, and it's, oh dear, that's that's difficult, that's hard. Hmm, it'll be interesting to see. How are they, uh, how are they going to, uh, what's the lesson going to be in this case? It's going to be an interesting one this time. Maybe one of these lessons where it's like, it, it applies specifically to the situation, but... How is this going to apply to us? Because, yeah, I mean, hmm. it could be just simply accepting something about your friends that you don't really want to accept and everything is that, you know, hmm. But anyway, oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. It's like, oh, poor Rainbow. And the main six are just like, um, oh, my gosh, I didn't know Rainbow could be this angry. Hide me. <laughs> they're just, oh, my gosh, they're so caught off guard and everything. It's like, oh. Oh, I mean, that's the sad thing about these kind of situations. It's often people do this not because they're mean, it's because they're upset about something else and everything. It's like, oh, dear. It's like, this is, this is cool. <laughs> Uh-oh, it's like, this is most likely going to descend into total chaos and bad things are going to happen. It's like, this isn't going to end well and everything. <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear. It's going to be, uh, dear. I can't think of much else to say to be honest because it's like it's kind of in a way obvious what's going to happen now it's like she's going to stop the weather and stop winter from happening that's not going to end well <laughs> never things like this never end well <laughs> but it, i hope it'll be fun though sort of <laughs> ah dear oh dear ah, fortunately the show is back so yes <laughs> Ah, more clouds. Ooh, a new hairstyle. So, where do these clouds go? Over by clear skies. But there's clear skies everywhere. <laughs> Yo, clear skies right here. But there's clear skies over there, too. <laughs> That's open skies. There's open skies everywhere. I'm not everywhere. I'm right here. Oh. So, you're open skies, and you're clear skies, hmm? then what's all that? <laughs> open, <laughs> clear <laughs> skies. Hey, where do fluffy clouds go? Fluffy clouds? He's over there. <laughs> nice, Stop nice routine. Winter is gonna be a breeze. Uh oh. I think the tree is about to explode. Run! Oh. Yeah. 
guy. <gasps> a song! <laughs> when life gives you lemons, you can make lemonade. <laughs> but life made me tank here, and my choice has long been made. No winter will come to Ponyville. I'll do it on my own. I will keep you by my side, so I will not be alone. Oh, poor Rico. And I'll fly, and I'll fly until <laughs> the end of the sky. So I'll be the one who doesn't have to say goodbye. I'll clear the skies forever. I'll read a Rainbow Dash again. <laughs> that was a nice musical number with, unfortunately, an unconscious partner. <laughs> Here comes the next shipment. Move those clouds over. <laughs> Move the next shipment and do it now. <sighs> oh dear. For every hoof step back, they go three hoof steps forward. What are we gonna do? Oh dear. Hmm. Uh-oh. Hmm. Cloudsdale. That's it, Tank. Uh-oh. If I can't stop Winter in Ponyville, maybe I can stop it at the source. Uh-oh. That could be a really big problem. case of ponies sneaking around when they really jump. <laughs> Not to mention I think someone will notice the turtle. <laughs> like lunch! Lunch hour! Perfect! <laughs> <laughs> uh, of course the air vent. Get rid of these clouds, but that's still not 
not big enough. Oh dear. Uh -oh. Slam dunk! With no water, they can't make clouds or snow. Uh -oh. They can't make winter! Oh dear. This is not gonna I end I hate well. to do this to those weather ponies, but desperate times call for desperate measures. Oh dear. Oopsie. Looks like <laughs> these were a little loose. A little loose. Oh. And uh -oh. there goes winter down the drain. Uh oh. Um. Oh no. Nice save. Oh. <laughs> uh, I can't see. I can't see. I'm blind. No. <laughs> oh. Ow. 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 That looks like that hurt. Hmm. What's that? Ooh. <laughs> um. It's going to blow! Run! Let's get out of here! Uh oh. Uh oh. That doesn't. Uh... Oh no! Oh dear, this isn't gonna end well. Uh oh. Everybody run! What in the name of Celestia is going on up there? <laughs> Prepare yourselves, every pony. Winter is coming. <laughs> oh. Uh oh. <laughs> oh dear. Unfortunately, my first thoughts on uh, Rainbow Dash's uh, actions are: Is this would this be considered treason? Hmm. I think sabotaging Winter would unfortunately be considered an act of treason or something. So, uh-oh, that could be a problem. And it's like she's just destroyed all of the machinery. And, uh-oh, it's like, yeah, Winter is coming. Probably all at once. Mm, oh, dear. So, yeah, I mean, oh, for starters, I like that song. That song was nice. I mean, yeah, I was very silent during it because I'm trying to understand. I'm trying to listen and everything. And I must admit, my brain is malfunctioning and yuck, yuck, yuck. <laughs> everything's like, oh, let's get to bed earlier or something. I don't know. <laughs> but anyway, I, um, yeah, it's like, that was an interesting song. And, um, unfortunately, its message isn't exactly very nice, unfortunately, because it's, well, uh, in a typical Rainbow Dash way, Rainbow Dash is thinking only about what she wants and not what's best for other people and ponies and pets and everything. It's what she wants. It's like she doesn't, she hasn't considered the fact of, well, what if winter doesn't come? If she has to consider that, you know, it's like, oh dear. But that was, it was a nice number and it was really cool. And it's like, <laughs> and it's like, uh, Rainbow Dash has done this, this Lord, this new like spinning thing around. I can't, I can't believe it. Is this like, Rainbow Dash, the ballerina, <laughs> sort of a thing. It's like, oh, that goes against her character to be a ballerina. It's like, no, that would ruin her tough girl image. But, <laughs> but anyway, I like that. I mean, it's like, it's it's interesting. But I'm, it's definitely one of these cases. I'm not with Rainbow Dash on this one. It's like, this can only end in disaster. Rainbow. It's like, oh no. It's like, uh oh, oh dear. I mean, oh dear. <laughs> going to be interesting to see what happens now and how all the ponies um deal with this unfortunately because i mean it'll be okay it'll be fine but you know it's like oh dear these are some pretty uh drastic actions that rainbow dash is taking it's like i'm gonna stop winter just so that my friend won't have to go to hiber won't have to go into hibernation mm. oh dear that's that's rough that's <laughs> But in a way, that's a classic Rainbow Dash thing, and in a way, that's kind of good. It shows that, you know what, these conflicts, these issues, don't just you don't just snap your fingers and then it's like, okay, I've overcome that. It's like, no, some of those things you have to struggle with and everything from time to time. And uh, But I'm sure she will prevail in the end, as I'm sure we're about to find out. Oh, no. Everybody grab onto something. <laughs> Shut it down. Shut it down. Incoming! <laughs> Ooh. Oh dear. <laughs> they destroyed Ponyville. Again! 
Is everybody okay? I'm okay, Sarge. Oh. Tag, where are you? Uh, you okay, Tank? <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. Rainbow Dash, are you alright? Oh, no. Oh. Oh dear, poor Rainbow. Oh. <laughs> Knock, knock! <laughs> How are you feeling, Rainbow Dash? Okay. Whatever. Aww. The poor thing looks so sad. Just what are we going to do? I don't know what we can do. Buck up, Sugar Cube. You just ain't yourself these days. Whatever. Oh, dear. Oh. How can I say this tactfully? You've lost your sparkle, Rainbow Dash. I hate to say this, but, well, you've become... Oh, Didn't no. you hear me? I said, whatever. I don't know if you're here to cheer me up or what, but I'm fine. Mm. Let me handle this. <laughs> Rainbow Dash, your winter is going to be petless. Oh, dear. Wow, that was like a revolution for her. <laughs> oh, no! Rainbow's crying. It's... Oh, <laughs> Oh, it'll be okay, Rainbow. It'll be okay. What did you do that for? Because she'll never get past this until she lets it all out. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey. Uh, it's okay. Tank will come back in a few months. Months? <laughs> oh. Poor Rainbow. No. All right, all right. There, there. Nice going, Fluttershy. We get her to stop. She's got to be about done now. Can't be too much left in there. Can't be much left. <laughs> Feeling better? Aww. Aww. Darn it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh no, everyone's gonna cry now. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. I should be laughing, I guess, but. Nope, I'm good. No, I'm good. Look, every pony, I know how hard it is to say goodbye. I'm mostly sad because you're not sad. <laughs> What? What? Me? What? What about Applejack? Applejack cries on the inside, Twilight! It's true. <laughs> it's, it's true. It's all right, Fluttershy. It's all right. You think she's done or just getting a third wind? Oh, no. I don't know. Rainbow Dash, are you okay? <laughs> I think so. I feel better. Really, I do. Thanks, every pony. I don't know what I'd do without you. Aww. Poor him. Mm. Oh, poor Rainbow. <laughs> oh, Tank. I'm sure gonna miss you. Aww. Aww. <laughs> 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 Nice! <laughs> well, I guess we're starting winter with a bang. The bonds come early! Yeah! How? <laughs> you think we can mess up nice. winter every year? It's way less work! <laughs> um, I don't think Rainbow Dash could handle it. No. Riding that entire season from Cloudsdale to Ponyville was pretty awesome. <laughs> I thought you guys might like to say goodbye to Tank. He's ready to hibernate. Oh, you're using the word! Oh, she's <laughs> using the word! Yay! And when Tank finishes hibernating, I'm gonna throw him the biggest welcome home party ever! Or wait, should it be a welcome above ground party? Or a happy wake-up party? Maybe 
<laughs> it's about time party. Details, and details. And I designed him a very special suit just for the occasion. <laughs> whichever one it ends up being. I'm glad you're feeling a little better, Rainbow Dash. Yeah, me too. So, you really want to do this hibernating thing, huh? Goodbye, Tank. Oh, see you later, little fella. Tank. Goodbye, Tank. We'll miss you. Aww. <laughs> Oh, poor Rainbow. <laughs> well, ready for some winter fun? Uh, I'm gonna hang here and read to him a bit. Oh. That little guy can never get to sleep without a bedtime story. <laughs> uh, I'll be right there. And as always, thank you to you hardworking people for working so hard on the show. Yo! Hmm. Oh dear, oh dear. That was certainly interesting. So that was, um, um, <laughs> I don't remember the name of this episode. I forgot. No. <laughs> um, interestingly, this is written by, uh, Cindy Morrow, I believe one of the classic MLP writers. So hmm, interesting. Uh, I mean, hmm. An interesting thing is that all these episodes in a way are becoming, I think less fun and much more. I'm not going to say heavy, but I think the word might be deep or emotional or something. It's like, you know, every single one, it definitely is making you think a little bit, I think. Maybe. Maybe not so much in this case, but definitely in the the other episodes and everything. But yeah, I mean, this was a interesting episode. It kind of caught me off guard in a, kind of, in a, in a lot of different ways. I mean, um... In a way that was in a in a way sort of no central lesson here per se. Um, I guess in a way it's it just sometimes you just gotta let go. You gotta deal with things. I mean, it was interesting to see Fluttershy in this way. It's like she was <laughs> she was a she was blunt and direct, you know, in this episode. It was just like it's like and sometimes that's what you you have to do. Unfortunately, sometimes you need to say those things. It's like Rainbow Dash, you know, you're gonna be without your pet for the winter. Tank has to go. I'm sorry, Rainbow Dash. It's like that was that was a weird and awkward moment. It's like every pony's crying and it's sad. And, oh, it's like I mean, it's like this is like almost this is like a revolution. It's like Rainbow Dash never cries. I mean, maybe she's cried in the past or something, but it's like again that would destroy her tough girl image and everything. And you know, <laughs> and of course, as always, that's a an annoying stereotype that's not true it's like everyone cries at some point you know <laughs> just because you do doesn't mean you're not tough or anything it just means you're dealing with something that's hard and difficult <laughs> but you know that was uh, that was interesting I must admit, I just, uh, this is, uh, this episode is, I mean, not so much about fun, but definitely about dealing with, in a way, a specific issue, but it's kind of odd that they took on this issue, because they didn't really have to, I mean, the issue is that Tank has to go into hibernation, and basically has to go away for the winter, and sort of, like, they didn't really have to deal with that, per se, to be honest, but, <laughs> but, um, but they did bring up an interesting point here, is that I think, I guess the lesson is you gotta, just let go and accept things and deal with stuff you know it's like you can't stop there are some things you can't change that you know nothing's going to change the fact that winter's going to come and that the that tank has to go into hibernation nothing will change that there's nothing rainbow dash can do about it that certainly is in a way uh sort of a good lesson is that you know there's just some things you just can't do anything about i mean sometimes that depresses me to be honest but you know it's because yeah but yeah, and honestly, but yeah, but, but you just got to deal with that. You know, some things you just can't do anything about and everything. So, um, 
but it was touching. It's like, oh, <laughs> that was a touching scene at the end. It's like they're all oh, tanks going into hibernation. And we're not going to see him again until the end of winter. And that was touching. And that was nice. And it was it was an interesting ending on that one. In this one, it's like, you know, it's like you first at first. My first thought was like, you know, Rainbow Dash is still not letting go but she's still but she's but she's actually can't but she's it's because she cares and she was like i'm gonna give tag a, a i'm gonna read her a good uh a bedtime story and then i'm gonna go and you know have fun with my friends and everything and that was that was kind of cool in any way so so she's so she's sort of letting go there and i like that i mean there's um in a way a lot to stop and think about on this one because there was a lot of firsts in this episode like we got to see spike's room we got to see more of cloudsdale we got to see all the machinery that's in the cloudsdale which has now been um blown up and destroyed by rainbow dash mm. <laughs> i'm surprised you didn't get into trouble for that but you know but in a classic milo pony way even if they had realized that i don't think they would have been too hard on her to be honest it's like you know it's like she's, oh dear but anyway um <laughs> but yeah I mean, this episode was emotional but perhaps not the most fun i mean i i do almost want to say if i could say something to dhx i would say i'm glad that you're doing all these these thoughtful and, and quote unquote deep episodes but at the same time i i want i would like to have the show be a little bit more fun i'd like it to be a little bit more enjoyable and a little less hard to be honest i mean this doesn't necessarily go into the hard episode category it comes sort of close because yeah, I realize, because I understand what's going to happen. Rainbow Dash is going to go crazy. She's going to cause, she's going to make this a horrible mess and everything, and it's going to end badly. So it's like, I know what's about to happen. Rainbow Dash doesn't even realize that that's what's about to happen or that that could happen. And she doesn't even think about what the consequences of her actions could be and everything. So it's kind of, mm, I'm not with you on this one, Rainbow Dash. Sorry. Oh, dear. But, you know, I understand. It's like, she's, 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 she's almost in a panicky kind of, oh my gosh, I have to do something. Otherwise, I'm going to lose my friend. I'm not stressed. I'm totally fine. <laughs> is in a way what Rainbow Dash is. That's the mode that she's in for most of this episode. It's like, I'm perfectly fine, I tell you. No. <laughs> and of course, she's not. You know, when people tell you they're fine, they're often, they're not. <laughs> oh. And that was an interesting, again, back going back to that scene, that was an interesting thing. It's like Applejack cries on the inside and everything. It's like, yeah, it's true. <laughs> it's like, I kind of like that. That's sort of true in some ways as well and everything. And that was, and was in a way an interesting thing into the main six six character and everything. And, hmm, this is just, this was, this was just so touching though. It was nice. And we did get a pretty cool song. It's um it's a pretty nice song i kind of like it but it's a specific song it's a song de 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 dealing with this exact specific situation so it's not like you know smile 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 where you could just watch by itself and it would be cool it's dealing with the specific goal of what rainbow dash wants to do and it's not exact and it's tone i mean what it's what its message is is you know rainbow dash is going to go and do this and she doesn't she's going to keep her friend from hibernating and she doesn't care what the consequences are it's a little difficult but you know that's fine i still kind of like that song and um hmm. so this episode overall was it was okay it was actually pretty good it was kind of hard but it was interesting to say the least and we did get to see uh, you know other things that we've never seen before we've got some of the background ponies and these are new background ponies if i offhand to be honest and they had what was like a i always want to think like a three stooges moment probably not really but there was three of them and it's like <laughs> and it was kind of funny and everything and that was kind of nice and everything uh and and, and it was a great it was a great classic comedic you know slash magician thing of like you know they're distracting us from the fact that rainbow dash is stealing all the clouds <laughs> which i kind of liked and yeah we got to see winter it's like obviously we've seen winter wrap up but we've never seen how winter gets started and everything and, we, and in a way the circle is now complete <laughs> and everything so that's kind of cool and um we we simply got to see a lot of things that we didn't get to see before and it may not have been the most fun but it was interesting so so as always good job and yo -ho. and uh ah, it was pretty cool i liked it so anyway um so i guess this is the end of this uh comrade video oh darn it i keep wanting to call these comrade videos because i I like my made-up word. <laughs> so anyway, I hope you enjoyed this uh, blind reaction video. And as always, thank you for commenting, liking, and subscribing. And until next time, this is Blue Star. Stay strong and pony on.
blue star out.